Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this tutorial, I'll show you how I play Red Dead Redemption 2 using Dynamic Super Resolution, DSR, combined with Lossless Scaling Frame Generation, LSFG 3.0. This setup gives me better image quality and a much smoother frame rate, even on a 1080p monitor, even higher. So if you want next level visuals without upgrading your hardware. So stick around and follow each step carefully. First, we need to activate Dynamic Super Resolution DSR, using the NVIDIA Control Panel. Right-click on your desktop and open NVIDIA Control Panel. On the left menu, go to Manage 3D Settings, then find the DSR Factors option. If you're using a 1080p monitor, check the boxes from 2.00x to 4.00x. This enables resolutions like 1440p, 1620p, 2160p, and so on. After that, adjust DSR smoothness to 15% or 20% for better visual clarity. Click Apply to save the changes. Now you've unlocked high-resolution rendering for any game, including Red Dead 2. Next, we'll apply the DSR resolution to your desktop. Why? Because lossless scaling FG only works in windowed or borderless mode, not in full screen. Here's how to do it. Right click on the desktop, open display settings. Scroll down to display resolution and click the drop down. You should now see new high res options like 2160p selected. Your screen and icons will look tiny. Don't worry. To fix that, scroll down to scale and layout and change it to 200%. This scales everything to look normal on your desktop. After you're done playing and want to set back to default settings on desktop, follow the steps. Set your resolution back to your native one, like 1080p. Set scale back to 100%. If things still look off, sign out or restart your PC to reset everything fully. Before launching the game, Let's make sure you're using your monitor's max refresh rate. In Display Settings, scroll to Advanced Display Settings. Click on Display Adapter Properties. Go to the Monitor tab and set your native refresh rate. Mine is 75 Hz. Click Apply and close everything. Now we're fully set up for gameplay. Launch Red Dead 2 and go into the Graphics Settings. Set the resolution to something like 1871p or 1620p. 2160p might be too heavy for your GPU and could cause artifacts. Set the display mode to windowed. Because we already applied 2160p as desktop resolution, window mode now renders the game at high res correctly. For graphic settings, use high or medium for most options. Set texture quality to ultra. For me, High textures caused weird graphical issues. This combination gives you a great balance between visuals and performance. Now it's time to activate Lossless Scaling Frame Generation 3.0. Launch Lossless Scaling and copy this setting. To activate Lossless Scale, press the Window key on your keyboard and select the Lossless Scale tool. And click the Scale button and re-select the Red Dead Game window again. Now you can see the Lossless Scale correctly activated. Here's a quick look at my benchmark. My system is capped at 30 frame rate for consistency using RTSS on MSI Afterburner. Gameplay drops to around 22 frame rate because while recording, I lose about 7 frame rate which is why some ghosting artifacts might appear in the footage. But when I'm stopped recording, the gameplay is smooth and stable 50 frames rate. This setup is a great option for better quality and performance, especially on mid-range hardware. So that's how I play Red Dead Redemption 2 using DSR with lossless scaling FG 3.0. 
if you follow these steps, you should get better visuals and a smoother frame rate, even on a 1080p screen. Let me know in the comments how it works for you, or if you run into any issues, I'm here to help. If this tutorial helped you, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tips like this. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video, and happy gaming. Camp's up this way. Come on. Charles, you take the right. I'll go left. Okay. Take him down. God damn army of these bastards. How much is Sean's bounty? Still time. You're making heavy work of this, aren't you? You know, you're a lot less ugly from that other angle, Arthur. Come on. Do I get a hug, Arthur? A warm embrace for a lost brother now found.